What's he doing? Harry turning laughing stock for Hollywood Botox makeover and his fuller hair. Prince Harry might have embraced his genetic propensity to be taller than his hair, but has the 37-year-old father of two started doing something about his forehead lines? The Duke of Sussex looked remarkably fresh-faced during a virtual conference earlier this month for his mental health charity, Better Up, renewing rumors he's had a Hollywood makeover since moving with his family to California. Harry has come to terms with his hairline, says a source. The mocking he got when that story came out about him seeing a hair plug expert, shortly after his wedding, was enough to put him off trying to fool the public about it. But being married to a former actress, he's definitely come round to the LA way of thinking. In that aesthetic work is the same deal as a haircut. According to Detroit-based plastic and cosmetic surgeon to the stars, Dr. Anthony Yoon, whatever Harry's had done, he looks great. He adds, he may have had a touch of Botox to smooth the lines, but that's about it. Our source adds, he's got to live by Hollywood standards now. His frown line was nothing short of an oddity to his new circle of friends. Hosts of the royally obsessed podcast Roberta Fiorito and Rachel Bowie discussed Prince Harry's latest video with Company Better Up where he discussed burnout and prioritizing self-care. But the two royal experts were drawn to the video for the Duke of Sussex's new haircut as they much preferred his old look. Ms. Fiorito remarked it made Prince Harry look balder and a close military cut does not work when you don't have much hair to begin with. Speaking on the Royally Obsessed podcast, Ms. Fiorito and Ms. Bowie analyzed the Better Up video and could not stop laughing at the Duke of Sussex's new look. Ms. Fiorito joked, I will say, his hair threw me for a loop on this one. He is so much balder with this haircut. I mean, what's he doing? What's going on? It was so much better when it was shaggy on top. It was like a close military cut but when you don't have a lot of hair up there it's just. I don't know. Mr. Fiorito wanted to know if she was being mean to Prince Harry with Miss Bowie explaining the black shirt may have boldened his hair more. Despite the reservations from Miss Fiorito, some royal fans were more complimentary of Prince Harry's new look. According to Sussex Live, one fan wrote, H looks like an American white guy. Sorry Brits, he's home now. Another added, Prince Harry has been doing some outer work too because he's looking hella fit. Meanwhile, in the stands at the Super Bowl on Sunday, Prince Harry looked like a new man. Harry's been sporting a new hairdo in recent weeks, prompting rumors that the prince has gone under the knife. Gook Hanvaney, a hair transplant specialist at Vera Clinic, says it could be true. Harry's hair seems fuller and thicker, he shares. But ultimately, I suspect Harry has grown out his hair and switched up the products he may be using. His Super Bowl appearance wasn't the first time Eagle Eyed fans saw a difference in those ginger locks. Gook Han explains the prince's options, Harry has potentially used hair thickening treatments or grown his hair out the last few weeks to gain this thicker hairstyle. Hair supplements can improve the overall thickness of hair. Harry may also have seen a private dermatologist for further medical advice. Dr. Anub Pakar Hull, medical aesthetic consultant at Harley Street Specialist Hospital agrees, Harry's definitely done something. But there's a less invasive and non-surgical option I'd recommend, microneedling with induced growth factor therapy. Dr. Anub Pakar Hull says Harry's hair loss may have really impacted his mental health. He said, it's true that Harry has had hair thinning problems over the previous years, resulting in near bald patches towards the crown of his head. This should not impact how the nation views and respects Harry, the hair improvement may show a sign that Harry now has more confidence within himself.